150, bringing the balance down. Then we'll go to, to C company over here. We're gonna bring it down with a credit. So we are in AC7 within AC7 equals point to that 2150, bringing the balance down to zero. And that then means that if we add up all of our subsidiary ledger accounts, adds up to 24343, that then matching the 24343 on the trial balance. Scrolling back over, we're going to do this calculation for C company. Same type of calculation. We're going to say that uh, we had the beginning balance starting at 2150. 2150. They also had a 10% interest rate. So it looks like the interest just went up. It's not, it's not the customer word. Interest rates went up. That's just how it happens over time. So then we're going to go to the home tab, font and underline, and we'll multiply that out. So we're going to say this equals the 2150 times 10%. So that's G18 times G19, giving us the 215 per year. Remember that's per year. We're going to break that out per day by dividing by the number of days rounded to equals 12 times 30, 12 months times 30 days or 360. We will underline that going to the home tab font, underline, do the calculation, the division problem, the uh, total for a year divided by the number of days, interest per year divided by days in a year, equals the interest per year, 215 divided by days in a year, 360, and that gives 60 cents per day. Then we're going to say the number of days outstanding, if we scroll back over, 60. 60, is that right? Yeah, it looks like 60 days, so I'm going to put 60 here and underline that. So we're going to go to the uh, home tab and uh, font and underline. And then we'll multiply that out the interest per day times the number of days equals the 60 cents per day times number of days, uh, 60 days, giving us the uh, 35.83. And then we'll just round that saying equals the 35.83 giving the, the 36 and I actually made an error here notice it says 9% rather than the 10% I picked up from the prior one so it looks like interest went that back down and note that because we used formulas I can go up here and just change this 10 to a 9 and this 36 will calculate down to 32 so it'll do that all for us meaning if I do the same calculation this is how many 